Welcome everybody to another, this is just not even an episode or a game, this is a discussion of, about the WWE Supercard packs and buying packs. I've had a lot of people saying that, oh, if you buy packs, you're cheating. That's not the case, because if it was considered cheating, they would not put the packs in the game to buy. You got to remember, some of us, some of these YouTubers, and I'm not saying myself, because I'm new at this, and I'm trying to balance myself on what works. You got some of these YouTubers, like Biggie Dude, Biggie Dad, Sonny and Dallas Morale, that play the game traditionally from start to finish. They'll probably buy like the bouts or the energies. And I know Biggie Dad does not. I'm not sure about Sonny. But Biggie Dude buys the bouts for some things and the energies for King of the Rings if he's really busy. Did you have like the real Fuji, and I'm not sure if Edge Punk Dude does, and I'm not sure if uh, Super Oh My God Barbecue does or not. But the way they've been up there with the high, I, they might. But they buy packs because just like wrestling, their YouTube is a gimmick. Their gimmick is they're good. And if you have the money, do it. But to me, if it's in the game, it's not considered cheating. It's, yes, it, 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 it's an advantage over everybody else, but it's still not cheating. I may bought some here and there, and I will buy some con here and there. But... I tried to keep up with the others. When I started falling back again, I stopped. I'm not saying that I'm stopped with the whole buying thing. I think it's okay to buy packs here and there. But all my cards are ultra rare pros, except for the Divas. Because I'm still guessing that the game is sexist and all you're getting is superstars anyway. But I'm struggling just like everybody else with what level I have. Just because I bought a couple packs and end up pulling one rare card out of the whole thing does not make me a cheater. I just tried to keep up with some of the other ones, even though some of the other ones have more money than I do. I don't. Th I can't consider it cheating. Some of you other people may consider it cheating. And I apologize if you think that of me. But I'm just trying to balance my deck out like other the other ones are. And try to keep up with them. And forgot the, there, there's other people that actually consider or think that it, it is cheating. And I do apologize. But we got to remember, YouTube and these and these people, YouTube is their gimmick. Rather, they have real lives or not, like real jobs. It's like wrestling. Like I said, it's like wrestling. Wrestling, you have your gimmicks. You got your heels. You got your faces. You got your bad gimmicks. You got your good gimmicks. YouTube and our common tutity, like uh, Biggie Dude says, is our family. And it's like a, I'm not, and it's, and I went off topic a little bit, but it's like a gimmick in the WWE. Their, some of their gimmicks are getting all these legendaries and epics and try to advance to more legendaries. That's fine. 
that's what they do. There are some like Biggie Dude, Biggie Dad, Sonny, that start from the bottom and work with what they have. That is their philosophy. Then there's people like me that's trying to balance out both situations to see what's working for them. And apparently, some people have a problem with that. Like I said before, I'm sorry. But you can't really consider it as cheating because if it was cheating, they wouldn't put it in the game. That is my philosophy. And that is the video, a short little rant that I had about the WWE superstars and pack buying. In the comment section below, let me hear your opinions and everything. Everybody's opinion matters. Good, bad, negative, positive. I do not hold it against you unless you really tick me off because someone already did and I blocked them from my channel. I believe. But anyway, I don't like being called a cheater or a liar. But people are entitled to their own opinions. So, on that note, good gaming and have a good day, rest of your day. And I will see you on another episode of WWE Supercards. For Fireproof Tim Shepard, I'm out.